Hi there, this is Jennifer with Brome Fields and today is day 11 of our 21 days of cable knit stitches. And today's stitch is a basic four step cable and we're gonna keep it um, pretty easy today. We've had a couple of uh, interesting patterns the last two days. So we're gonna just gonna take it easy today and do some cable for uh, backs. And it is just creating kind of diagonals, repeating diagonals. Um, this is only a six row repeat. So on the wrong side rows are all knit and purl stitches. And then I will be showing rows two, four, and six. I have 14 stitches on my cable needle or on my needle. It is a size 15 needle and I am using Knit Picks uh, Big Cozy Yarn and it is a super bulky yarn. Um, and it doesn't say what size of needle to use, but I'm using a size 15. You could probably even bump it up to a 17 if you want to. It's pretty bulky. So I've already um, knitted row one because it is the wrong side of our work. So I am ready to knit row two. So with the yarn in the front, we're gonna slip one purl wise and purl one. And then we're gonna cable four back. So I'm gonna hold that in the front of my work without losing those stitches. I'm gonna slip two on the cable needle and hold it in the back. And then we're gonna knit two off our left hand needle. So you can see there, that's the cable. And then bring that in the front there. Pull that so we don't lose those stitches, but not too far. And then we're gonna knit these two off the cable needle. And then we're gonna knit two and then we're gonna cable four back again. So these are all cable four backs. There's no twists and no cable fronts. It's just putting them in different places. Then we're gonna knit two off our left hand needle. And then we're gonna knit two, we're gonna bring all that into the front, pull that so we don't lose those two stitches yarn behind the cable needle to knit these two stitches. And then we're gonna purl this reverse stocking knit stitch. And with the yarn in front, slip one purl wise. So we're just moving every other row, we're gonna move this diagonal a little to the, the right and then we're going to end it. So I will be back with row four. Alrighty, so now we are ready for row four and it has only one cable in it. So with a yarn in the front, we're going to slip one purl wise, purl this first stitch and then we're going to knit four because that's the end of that stitch or that cable. Two, three, four. And then we're gonna move this cable one over or two over to the right. So we're gonna hold the, yarn, the right hand needle in the front, slip two stitches off the left hand needle and hold them in the back. Knit two off the left hand needle and then we're gonna knit two off the cable needle. Very carefully. Don't think I've mentioned that this is like juggling in a couple videos, but it is. And then we're going to knit two and purl one. And with the yarn in front, slip one purl wise. Now the, on the front, this 
the basic fourth step is the 10 stitches. And then we have four stitches on the outside that are our border stitches, our edge. So these 10 stitches in the middle on the right side of your work are always knit stitches. So on the back, there are always purl stitches. So here on the reverse side, you're knitting the knits and purling the purls. So I'm going to knit row five and then I will be back with row six. All right, so I'm back for row six and this one only has one cable on it also. So we're still moving this left one to the right two stitches. So that's all we're doing is just moving them a little to the right, not a little to the left. So with the yarn in the front, slip one purl wise. Okay, if you guys are Gilmore Girl fans, um, you know what I mean, a little to the left. The, the dog, I can't remember his name, the guy that did Lorelei dates. Anyways, <laughs> we'll go back here. So slip one purl wise, purl that first uh, gutter stitch there and then we're going to knit two and then we'll cable four back. So with the yarn in the front, we're going to slip two stitches off, hold them in the back of our work, knit two stitches, and then knit the two stitches off of the cable needle. Yeah, with roving, you do have to be pretty careful not to, to split the stitch. So now we're going to knit four, one, two, three, four, and purl one, and with the yarn in front, slip one purl wise, and that's it. Just keep repeating those six rows over and over again. So in the next row, you can see we're ready to do two. So we're going to bring this diagonal over one more to here. So we're going to bring it over here to end it. And we're going to begin a new one right there, right here. So that is a four step cable, a very basic stitch and it's a right leaning uh, cable. So I hope you guys enjoy today's basic stitch uh, cable and I will see you guys tomorrow for day 12.